Hello and namaste to everybody. I keep getting this particular message a lot in my Instagram DMs nowadays and it actually annoys me and pisses me off to even read that particular question. So I thought I will make a video in response to this and tell you what I think about it. The question is the complaint is that oh it's so hot and we are finding it very hard to train to run in the outdoors for even 1 hour or to do anything in the outdoors because it's so hot especially in india my response to all of these people you can't handle a little bit of suffering you can't handle a little bit of pain and you can't handle a little bit of heat for 1 hour in a day and you talk about climbing mountains where the suffering would be 100 times more it's better if a spoiled brat like you sits in his ac room lives a comfortable life and only watches videos of people like me climbing mountains okay because if you can't handle one hour of suffering then i don't think you are ready to climb mountains that's my honest opinion dil se it might sound very brash but that's true let me tell you guys something when i was training for my everest or annapurna expedition i used to do my morning training and at 12 in the noon i used to leave my home in the mountains in maharashtra to go out for a trek it was not for my physical training physical training was done finished in the morning it was to train this to suffer and to push through it because somewhere instinctively because somewhere through observing my own body and my mind i knew that the way the body and the mind will react in extreme heat is the way the body and the mind will react when it is extremely cold up there in the mountains and let me tell you one thing those 12 pm hikes in maharashtra in the sayadris were not for my physical training to make my body stronger it was to make my mind stronger it was to break my body to a point that the body does not want to walk anymore it wants to give up it wants to quit it wants comfort it wants to preserve itself but this trek was to make my mind so strong that even if my body is feeling weak even if my body wants to quit the mind has to become so rigid so stubborn and so strong that it will pull the body so eventually after putting yourself through suffering after suffering after suffering and still not quitting the body adapts the body realizes that okay this mind is so stubborn that the next time the suffering comes maybe it won't quit it will make me push it will make me walk regardless of how the body is feeling so i better learn to adapt to this rigid stupid mind and the body has a big self preservation instinct so it adapts to suffering because human beings are very good at adapting to even the most extreme or the worst circumstances so if it is too hot outside don't think that you can't run if it is hot outside especially go out for a run because it is not about the body it is for you to learn that even if you will be suffering up there in the mountains you will be still be able to put one step in front of the other and that is what mountaineering is being able to put one step in front of the other no matter how you are feeling because everybody will feel tired and if you are not used to suffering if you are a little spoiled brat who can't handle one hour of hot sun then you will not be able to suffer 100 times extra suffering that the mountains give you up there and here it's for one hour there it's for hours and hours days weeks and even a month maybe on these big 8000 meter expeditions right so the sun is a very good test this sun is the best training partner or the best coach that anybody who is living in the cities and wanting to train for the mountains can have because with each training where you are suffering if you complete that you will get more confidence you will learn and understand <clears throat> that even in the most extreme situations your body your mind is able to pull through and i think that is what mountaineering is or rather i would say that is what the art of mountaineering is that you suffer but you keep walking and in that pushing you will learn some things about yourself and you will grow as a human being so if it's hot train if it's cold train if it's raining go out and train stop giving excuses right so <laughs> yeah that's all i wanted to say keep pushing keep climbing jai hind jai maharashtra thank you